Leicester's underground is not a public transportation system. It is what Leicesterians choose to ignore. The depression, anxiety and low self-esteem that has a white knuckle grip on our inner city society. The lack of knowledge of what is going on around our communities. The low expectations of ourselves and those around us. Letting our dreams slip away and settling for second best. Multicultural. Vibrant. Diverse. Multicultural. Vibrant. Open. Multicultural. Lots and lots of different people from many ethnicities and cultures. There's loads of restaurants. It's not segregated, so it's like quite diverse. It's a melting pot of cultures. They're quite quirky. But it's quite good because there's like a wide variety of people from society. That's what makes Leicester unique. It's not a one-dimensional city. There's there's something, there's something going on in every little corner if you, if you know where to look. Promotion of it. So that's the one thing I've gone on and on about in the last few weeks is what well, me personally, I don't know a lot of the things that are going on. We have more like attractions and more things to do in Leicester. I'd give people more of a say on how the city can be run and what goes on in the city. Somewhere to go in during yeah. the day, you know what I mean? Yeah, something to do. Yeah, yeah something to do. The traffic. I hate the traffic. Schools are very academic though, they focus very much on um, you know, like science, English, math, they don't really focus on talent or potential. So if a person's talented in something like art, they don't really, they don't get to express that so much in, in school. It's more like, you know, just put in the corner, don't do that, do this. Creative. Comely? Com comely. Comely? Yeah, comely. It means nice. Oh, okay. Creative. Cultural. I'd like to stick to community. Realistic. Resilient. I'm going to use the word responsibility. <laughs> Amazing. Active. Adventurous. Approachable. Personality. Just the word people. Proud. I'd probably try and sign off a, a festival which was uh, free to the public. I'd give free beer out to everyone. I'd teach people how to respect each other more. Organise loads of events and stuff that bring people together. I'd have a day that, you know, everybody's off. A working, work free day. I try and influence other people to try and, you know, talk to other people, other cultures. I'd probably get to the root of, I'd probably hold a big, not a debate, but just somewhere where you can come and voice your opinion.